Bobby Orr, A Hockey Hero's Journey In the world of ice hockey, legends are born and heroes are made. One such hero that etched his name forever in the annals of the sport is Bobby Orr. Known for his exceptional skills, Orr's journey from a young boy's dream to becoming an iconic figure in the game is nothing short of extraordinary. This video delves into the inspiring story of Bobby Orr's tremendous achievements and the impact he left on the sport. Early Life and to Hockey Bobby Orr was born on March 20, 1948, in Perry Sound, Ontario, Canada. Growing up in a small town, Orr developed an early passion for ice hockey. He began playing the sport at the tender age of five and showed exceptional talent even as a young boy. Orr's extraordinary skills quickly caught the attention of coaches and scouts, leading him to join the Oshawa Generals in the Ontario Hockey Association, OHA, at just 14 years old. Professional Career with the Boston Bruins In 1966, Bobby Orr made the leap to professional hockey, signing with the Boston Bruins at the age of 18. This signing marked the beginning of an incredible career that would revolutionize the game. Orr's style of play was unique and transcendent. He redefined the role of a defenseman, blending offensive capabilities with defensive prowess. Orr became the youngest player in NHL history to win the Norris Trophy, awarded to the league's best defenseman in his rookie season. Over the next eight seasons, he continued to dominate the league, winning an additional six Norris Trophies consecutively. Orr was also an exceptional offensive force, leading the league in scoring as a defenseman not once, but twice. His breathtaking speed, agility, and scoring ability made him a nightmare for opposing teams. The Stanley Cup Triumphs While individual awards and records were impressive, Bobby Orr's ultimate goal was to win the Stanley Cup, the pinnacle of success in ice hockey. In the 1969-70 season, Orr achieved his dream as he led the Bruins to their first Stanley Cup victory in 29 years. Incredibly, he scored the series-clinching goal in overtime, forever immortalized in the iconic photograph of him soaring through the air, arms outstretched. The Bruins' success continued, and Orr repeated his heroics by leading the team to another Stanley Cup victory in 1972. Orr's contributions to the game were unparalleled, as he won the Conn Smythe Trophy as the playoffs' most valuable player both years. These achievements cemented his status as one of the game's all-time greats. Injuries and Untimely Retirement Despite his meteoric rise and extraordinary achievements, Bobby Orr's career was plagued by injuries. Persistent knee problems eventually forced him into early retirement at the age of 30 in 1978. The hockey world mourned the loss of a player who had forever changed the game's landscape. Legacy and Impact Bobby Orr's impact on ice hockey transcended his playing career. He left an indelible mark on the sport, influencing future generations of players and redefining the role of defensemen. Orr's offensive abilities inspired young players to become more involved in the scoring aspect of the game, transforming the way defense was played. His speed, stick handling, and vision set new standards for generations to come. Off the ice, or has remained involved in the game as an agent, coach, and philanthropist. He established the Bobby or Hockey Group, an agency that represents promising young talent and has given back to the sport through various charitable endeavors. Bobby Orr's journey from a small town in Canada to becoming one of the greatest ice hockey players in history is a testament to his exceptional talent, dedication, and passion for the game. His revolutionary style of play, his numerous accolades, and his Stanley Cup triumphs have solidified his place in hockey lore. Bobby Orr will forever be remembered as a hockey hero whose impact extended beyond the rink, inspiring future generations to chase their dreams and leave their mark on the sport they love.